and rescue, recovery, and rebuilding. That's the process anytime a natural disaster strikes. It was certainly that way in Louisville 10 years ago. Our Caitlin Yateman has the story on how one family's loss and how the communities stepped up to help. And it was scary. I wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy. It was a day that changed everything in Winston County. With the storm on the way, Kenesha White Jones and her grandmother took shelter. Their home took a direct hit. I looked out the window, I saw everything getting white. So I got in the closet. And as soon as she closed the closet door, it seemed like a sweep. Just like everything in the house just started bamming me in the back. Just hitting us. And when it all quit, we was out in the yard. And a truck had rolled over. If the truck would have rolled over again, it would have been on top of me and her. And just like that, their lives were changed. I couldn't go back to work because I fractured my back. And just to see my grandmother's house gone, she didn't have nowhere to live. That is where recovery groups stepped in. Long-term Community Recovery Committee Winston Strong was formed. We started Winston Strong during the recovery period. And we started training case managers to help people. And for the next two years, we were in the rebuild. They were instrumental in the rebuild process, including for Jones. They built an addition onto her home for her grandmother to live in. Reverend Mike Dowd said he thinks the community has come back stronger. I'm proud to live in the community of Winston County where we rebuilt. This community came back stronger than it went into it. And that that's just says a great deal about the, the character of the community and the people that live in it. In Louisville, telling your story, Caitlin Yateman, WCBI News. Reverend Dowd said Winston Strong helped rebuild 23 homes and repair over 60 others.